This video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. It is for entertainment purposes only. The one, the only, a father in the house, baby. Wow! I keep getting these comments from, uh, you know, these losers that follow my course, <laughs> you know, they're saying that I'm a clout chaser. This is what they say. They're like, you're only mentioning my course. And my course said this himself. He goes, the, uh, the only reason why I'm big, as he said, uh, is because I use his name. Okay. And I use Trey, uh, Trey's name. Listen, first of all, my course, let me just make something simple. You're not Trey. Okay. Trey is 100% a good, strong ape. I have nothing bad to say about Trey. He was in the military. He's positive. You know, whenever there were questionable things like, you know, the ape fest, you know, and uh, the GoFundMe page with Chad Brewer, Trey was, you know, very questionable about it. You know, I was watching his videos and he's like, you know, guys, you have the right to do it's your money, but I don't know if I trust it, you know, this GoFundMe page with Chad Brewer. And he said, I don't know if I trust this ape fest. So I have the utmost respect for Trey. Okay. He was in the military. He's a patriot of our country. God bless him. I have nothing bad about Trey. But Matt Coors, you're trying to compare yourself to Trey. Let me tell you something. You're only successful because of Trey. You're nothing. OK, you're nothing. OK, he tries to say that, you know, you 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 rode Trey's balls to get to where you are. OK, OK. All you do, you want to know why Matt Kors even got followers is because, you know, he's a little weasel. You know, every single video that this guy puts out, every video, it, it's like, you know, AMC is going to squeeze. AMC is going to squeeze. Right. The squeeze played. He's been doing this for months. I think he opened his, his account in March. OK. That's a clout chaser. You want to know who a clout chaser is? Matt Cause. People who put, okay, these clickbaits, you understand? I can do it too. You ever notice the A follow doesn't do it? What do you think? I can't do it? I can make every video. And you know what I could say? AMC is going to 100,000 this week. AMC is going to Moaz this week. AMC is going to squeeze this week. Now, if I did that and you called me a clout chaser, I would agree with you. But guess who does that? Matt Cause does that. Matt Cause is the cloud chaser. I'm not the cloud the, the cloud chaser. Guys, I've lost, let me tell you, here's the facts. I lost over 300 subscriptions mentioning Matt Cause names. You know, I lo I'm losing. <laughs> I'm losing subscriptions and you're still telling me I'm a cloud chaser? You might say, so then what's your motivation? My motivation is this. I want to get every ape on the same page. This is what my motivation is. I want to be a millionaire. I want to be rich. And I want you, I want everyone listening to the A-Faller to be rich and a millionaire. But we all have to be on the same page. We all, all apes have to be strong and think alike. Okay, we have to buy with diamond balls of steel, constantly buy, like all the time, guys. Every day. That's why I say fractional shares, because I know you can't buy 300, 400 shares a day. I mean, that's crazy, right? I mean, I get apes, they say that to me. I think it's great you're buying the 300 or 400 shares, but then if you can't buy AMC for another month, it's kind of defeating the purpose. You got to buy every day. So that's why I say buy $5 an hour, buy $10 an hour. You know, if we had 4 million apes, I keep saying this, if all the 4 million apes were buying $10 an hour, it's $40 million of buying pressure on Citadel an hour. That's better than apes just buying 100 or 200 shares and then they can't buy any AMC for another month. Don't you understand that? So I, I, I keep telling apes, listen to me. I know what I'm talking about. Buy fractional shares every hour, five, ten dollars an hour, fifteen dollars an hour, twenty dollars an hour. That's better than buying a whole, you know, load of AMC in one shot and then you can't buy anymore. OK, but I just wanted to say I'm sick and tired of everybody calling me a clout chaser. Like, if anything, mentioning Matt cause is losing me subscriptions. I'm doing it to protect my ape family because, you know, something he doesn't care. Listen to me. Matt Cause is making a fortune. Matt Cause is making $500,000, a million dollars a year off apes. <laughs> off apes. Like, we haven't Moaz yet. Apes haven't made money. A lot of apes are struggling. They're holding on for dear life. And this friggin' uh, Mama Luke, okay, this Nunad, okay, Matt Cause, Matt the Weasel, Matt the Rat, he's taking money away from apes who are struggling. That's what he's doing. To simply just to answer a question. Just to answer a question, like he knows everything. What does this guy know? This guy doesn't even know how to trim his eyebrows. He knows nothing, this guy. And you're giving him money? 
please give me a break. Give me a break. And what he's doing is most likely illegal. He's not a financial planner. He shouldn't be making $500,000 because when you're answering questions and you're getting paid for it, it's a form of financial advice. I think personally, I think Matt Cause is going to have an orange shoot on. He's going to be next to Ken, Ken Griffin in jail. If he keeps doing what he's doing, I told him he should have gave all the money, okay, to uh, to St. Jude's, not just ten thousand dollars. And then, like you know, his followers are trying to make it seem like this is a great thing he's doing. He's like, you know, something. He only gave the money from his T-shirt sales, his super chat T-shirts. Guys, how do you feel? That's good. How? What's wrong with all of you people? If the guy made five hundred thousand dollars and he's only giving ten thousand dollars. The guy's a low life. He's keeping four hundred and ninety thousand for himself. Now, if I did that, if the eight father did that, you guys would give me hell. <laughs> Could you imagine if I did that? Could you imagine if the eight father sold, like, say, five hundred thousand dollars worth of T-shirts, and I said I was going to help my eight brothers and I, my eight sisters, and I gave them ten thousand? I would hear from. God only knows how many people. God only knows how many people would give me hell. They would say, you piece of garbage. You horrible human being. But when Matt Cause does it, he's a great guy, right? He's a great guy. He's a low life. He's a low life. He's a weasel. He's a rat. He's a rodent. And let me tell you something. I am so confident, are you ready, that Matt Cause doesn't own any AMC that I'm even willing to bet it. I'm willing to bet on it. The guy doesn't own any AMC. Nothing. I'll tell you what, Matt, how about this? Show your portfolio that you own at AMC. And, I, and if you do, I'll tell you what, I'll walk the streets naked. I'll put AMC on my butt. I'll walk two or three blocks naked. Fair enough? <laughs> I'll do it. Okay, so isn't that a good listen, Matt? You want to make a fool out of me? You want to make a fool out of the eight fall? Here's my proposition. Show your portfolio. Are you ready? And I'll tell you what, I will walk three blocks naked. Three full blocks. I'll have someone film it, okay? Naked, okay, with AMC on my ass. I'll put markers. AMC, how's that sound? He won't show his portfolio because it's one of two things with Mac Oz. It's either he sold AMC because he did own it at one point. He probably sold it at 70 and he's embarrassed to show you the portfolio because he probably bought back in, let's say, in the 30s or maybe, who knows, the 28 level, who knows? So he's embarrassed, okay? Because obviously you're going to see he bought back in at a higher price, or maybe he doesn't own anything at all. Both cases are bad, okay? So anyway, I do this to protect my ape family. I just, all I want, you want to know something, guys? I don't give a shit about rat cause. I, Matt, just, I, you know what I said? I said rat cause instead of Matt. That's the, I like that name the best, rat cause. But anyway, I don't care about rat cause, okay? What I care about is going to Pluto. I want all the apes to know that we have a royal flush here with AMC, and we set the price. We own the float. We own a lot of the fake synthetic shares. We set the price. Citadel has to buy back the shares. Why should we Why should we sell low? Don't you understand when you listen to all these apes like that are telling you to swing trade or that are telling you to sell? Because a lot of apes are. Maybe you don't realize it, but indirectly, like, you know, with B. Hayes, when he says, you know, I think that AMC is going to go down, when he says things like that, it's like a subliminal message that apes are thinking, maybe I should sell. Because if I sell at, say, you know, 37 and it falls to 32, I can, you know, swing trade and I can get myself some free trades. But when you sell, you're helping Citadel. You're helping them cover their positions. Sell should not even be in our voc vocabulary, guys. The only sell should be at Pluto. All right, so that's all I got to say. I'm not doing this for clout. If anybody's doing it for clout, it's my cause. That's it. Rat cause.